Is there any possibility that these previous relationships with these guys that you were associated with could have anything to do with your feelings towards Rolo? You might not believe me, but the answer is no. All my okay. feelings about Rolo and my like thoughts about him have to do with my experiences with him and me reading his work. So uh, in terms of issues, I think probably one of my bigger ones is that I think he's a hypocrite. And I personally okay. don't like hypocrites. The reason I say he's a hypocrite, probably one of the biggest things is in his book, and yes, I am familiar with his work. He says, debate is how you get to the truth. You should always debate people who think differently than you, he says in his live streams. But yet he has run away from every single yeah. serious debate. And we're not talking just about with me. We're talking about with destiny. We're talking about with a whole bunch of people. So yeah. when I see something like that, and like, look, for someone like you, Michael, if you didn't want to do a debate, I wouldn't press the issue because you don't say, you don't LARP around and say, oh, my name is yeah. Michael, I debate everyone, right? So I think yeah. it's okay for people not want to do debates. But when your whole thing is you should debate people who think differently yeah. than you, and you run away from debates, especially when I've been more than accommodating, like mm -hmm. I offered top value team and hosted, right? So it was like, and he just still runs away from it. And that's, I'm like, okay, something is up. Okay. okay. So, so can I, can I propose a, a, a reason why this is, I'm just going to talk about your case specifically, because I happen to know the reason you okay. were very closely associated with someone who doxed his family member. You were very closely associated with someone who legitimately doxed one of his family members. I'm not going to go further by like, okay. like redoxing the person. We can talk offline. Okay. That would be a reason for me to not want to debate you if you had done. Now, you didn't do it, but you were very closely aligned with the person. Does that make sense? Yeah. So I think also. Can, 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 hold on. But can you can right. you at least understand like you and I don't have a daughter. Can right. you at least understand how maybe that would set somebody off in a, in a bad path? if you doxed someone's family member? Yeah, for sure. But just to yeah. clarify on that, I the person you're talking about, I was actually never closely associated with him. I spoke at his conference once. No, no, once. no, not, 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 not him, the other one. Really, he did? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, I'm so so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go I'm not gonna go deep into that, but you can you can understand, right? Like if you if you get into a hit and run and you kill someone's family member and later on you go to their house and you're like, hey, I want to come over for Christmas, if they don't invite you in for Christmas, you understand why, right? Like yeah, sometimes sure. I, I, get. I, I'm not your, I'm, I'm, I don't even think it's your fault, which goes back to my original point. I do think Alex respectfully, you were dragged into the, a really bad end of the pool by some really shitty people who, and, and which cause you to have create acrimonious relationships that you kind of can't come back from. Does that make sense? And I'm trying to help you come back from them so that we can have these debates, which I want you to have. Does that make well, sense? I, well, first of all, the the obstacle to having a debate isn't me. I'm 100 percent down. Anytime, any place. I'm right, but, but, but the op but the obstacle was because you were associated with people who have cluster B personality disorders. Do you understand? Yeah. So I'm honestly not a big fan of the guilty by association argument. Like, for sure. example, I could never, I would never call you a hypocrite because you're friends with Rolo. Like, you're your own man. Yeah. He's his own man. Yeah, so sure. any negative feelings I have about Rolo, I would never in a million years. Like put them on you. Yes, he has, you know, what I'm not sure what that person did, but I'm sure you're right. They have some bad blood, but that has nothing to do with me. I'm not gonna, I've never doxed anyone once in my life. I cool. have a really so, good track record of being very genuine, authentic, and good, good fit, right? So I don't, I don't see how, like, the fact that someone that I used to be friends with that something shitty to him has anything to do with me. Your association externally seemed probably a lot closer than it did probably for you internally. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Like for, for, the, for those of us out here, we all thought you guys were just boys, boys. I agree with you about the guilt by association, but if someone didn't want me to come on their podcast because they really didn't like Rolo, I would totally understand that because of my association with it. So I get it, even though I might not fully agree with it also. Mm -hmm.